So we are trying to look at an apartment in this community and we are being discriminated against because we are white. These are the people that won't let us into the community. We have a green health code, but they refuse to let us in only because we are white. So we've had to call the police. Meanwhile, we've been standing here for 15 minutes infecting everyone with our whiteness. Russian here, there's another Russian here, another Russian. There's a small girl here. They will not let foreigners go in. This is the guy. He says foreigners cannot buy masks or, in, or cannot enter, but Chinese can. We told them that we have all the documents, health certificates. They said they don't care. The police came and the police said, too bad, you can't enter. That's the rule of the building, so we can't enter. I told them, isn't this racist? They said, no, they don't care. It's racist or not. That's their policy. Sorry, 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 sorry. No enter. Oh no! Why? Why? Because she's a foreigner. Uh, why? Because she. We cannot enter. But then she's pregnant. We want to scan. I actually expected this. Okay, that is why I'm recording. So what is happening here is we went to some hospital. My wife is pregnant. We wanted to do a scan. But they cannot let us in. Foreigners cannot be let inside the hospital. Welcome back to my channel where I talk about basically anything I want. Now, today I want to talk about the xenophobia that's happening down in China. Now, China, China. What the... Come on, China. You can do better than that. Now, when the epidemic break out, you know what? I mean, I can't say the word because I'm trying to get monetized. Asians across America stand up and say, I am not a virus. And we all agree. I mean, no one is a virus. This epidemic is not specific to one race. But I guess China didn't get the memo. We all were superheroes when it comes to talking about, yeah, Asians are not a virus. Yeah, 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 yeah. We all had our cape on. We all had our cape on. But who's going to have our cape on for us in China? Because apparently in China, if you are a foreigner and if you are not of Asian descent, you are a virus. Check out these videos and I get back on my commentary. They think we are a virus. Now they don't. Now they don't. They don't use in mass. They are not. They are not worried in mass because they are far away from from me. You know, unbelievable, unbelievable. So here I am. You know, unbelievable. Yeah, if you come from Africa country, you can go in our building. Why? Uh, but I live in China for 20 years and I have already got my child and everything. Why can't I stay in China 20 years? What
other challenge is they are forcing us to test for COVID-19 because uh, they come to our houses with no notification. They just come to your house and ask for your passport. If you're African, they tell you that we've come to, uh, to, to test for COVID-19. If you're not African, they tell you no. And when they come, uh, they, after testing, they only tell you that we shall call you after three days when you're positive, and if you're not positive, no one will call you. Not us for crime, no, 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 no. You take this. No, we have, we have. I'm not sure of that. I'm not sure of that. You take this. Oh, we're getting taken. We're getting. They don't even allow us to stop the place. They are just, we are just walking on the road. You see, we are just. They cannot give us house. They cannot give us hotel. They cannot provide a place we can stay. They are just following us. You see, they are just following us. They don't want us to stay one place. After we have spent 15 days in the hotel, after quarantine, quarantine loss of 15 days. They cannot allow us to stay one place. They didn't give us any hotel. They are still chasing us. So while we are debating if it's a Chinese virus, if it's not, in China, there are some people that actually believe that foreigners brought the virus to China. And it's crazy. It's just absolutely crazy. When this thing started in Wuhan, China, our first reaction was to be nothing but sympathetic. And everybody that's of Asian descent that felt like they were being persecuted, some of us stand up and say, no, you cannot persecute these people. But what about us? What about us? What about us? What about my people that looks like me? 
black people are the ones that are treated even worse. They have harsher quarantine time. They're getting kicked out of their place um, that they have for years. They're just wandering the streets, just wondering, wondering, like they'll have a place to stay. Some of them end up being homeless. And when you look at the Chinese media, all they do is deny, 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 deny. <sighs> the videotape doesn't lie. The videotape does not lie. China, you have to do better. There are females that are pregnant and can't see a doctor. The inhumanity is just catastrophic. I mean, bumba clot. I mean, what is going on with y'all? What is going on with y'all? Because <sighs> imagine this. Imagine you are an Asian living in America and you're pregnant. You can't see a doctor. Imagine if you can't even go into some establishment because you are Asian, you know, whatever you are. This is a basic attack on the quality of life. This is a basic attack on humanity. And China, you must and you shall do better. The world is looking at you. Now, the reason why black people are getting harsher on um, quarantine time and facing this harsh reality is because five of them test positive for in a certain area of China. Now imagine this, imagine you have Asians in America or whatever country that they immigrated to and out of the millions of Asians, like five or three people test positive for an STD or a virus and guess what, we all turn on the million of Asians that are there. How is this fair? How is this fair? World, wake up, wake up. Why isn't anybody talking about this? Why isn't this on the news? For all you black people that go hard for K-pop or for anything that is not in your culture, I want to see you go hard too. If you're going to put those capes on like I did when Asian people are saying we are not a virus, then I need you all to put that cape on for us. Put that cape on for your people and for everybody that says, oh, this is not my problem, I'm white or whatever. White people are facing discrimination, just not at the degree that black people are facing discrimination. Latino people, you guys are facing discrimination too, just not at the degree that black people are facing discrimination. For some reason, ugh, black people were banned from McDonald's. Are you kidding me? Are you are you ki are, are you are you mad? Are you are you mad? Are you kidding me? Are you are you kidding me? The videos are looking really disgusting. When I search up xenophobia on the internet, the videos are looking very extremely disgusting. You have gang of people of Asian descent attacking black people, treating them as cattle, tying them up. The video was so gruesome that I couldn't even put it into this video. Just just go online and research. It's, it's there, it's there. I wanna see all the Asians that were feeling discriminated against and they put up content on the internet saying, I'm not a virus. I wanna see you have the same energy for your brothers and sisters that were fighting alongside with you. I wanna see you make content to showcase this, to put this in the media, to say, hey, they are not a virus too. I haven't seen not one video or content. I've seen someone comment. Say, hey, you know what? It's not fair how what they're doing to the foreigners that are in China. Um, I've seen Asian commented like that. I wanna see you guys have the same energy. Put that cape on, go to the store, pay for the cape, put it on and go save the day. Just like how we did for y'all. Keep that same energy because it's just disgusting the images that are coming out of China and it makes you guys look bad. And China, this is not a good look for y'all. This is not a good look for y'all. And this is very stupid on your part because you guys are going to the Caribbeans you guys are going to the African countries and you guys are setting up shop and you guys have made a lot of money from the resource that are in Africa. You guys don't use the local people that are there. Bring over your engineers and get them paid jobs. Bring over your construction workers and get them paid jobs. And maybe, maybe you guys give the locals some jobs, but for the majority of jobs that's created, it's occupied by Chinese people coming from China into those foreign countries, getting hired, getting the money and then going home. So China, if you guys are depending so much on foreign money and creating jobs for your people in China, why do you have these images online? It makes no sense. It makes no sense. It's common sense that takes that this is not gonna sit well with the countries that you guys are occupied in. This is not gonna sit well. 
what's going to happen is you're going to have retaliation because of the disgusting behavior that's happening in China. Nous respectons beaucoup les étrangers. Qu'est-ce que vous avez fait pour comprendre les problèmes Lui, c'est sa force là qui va vous arrêter Non. C'est son bois là qui va vous arrêter Non. Si on disait aux travailleurs, c'est aller chercher les bois. Ouais. Allez chercher les bois et venez aussi avec les bois. Venez les attaquer avec les bois. Qu'est-ce qui allait se passer C'est la mort. C'est la mort. C'est seulement en Guinée. C'est seulement en Guinée que ça peut se passer. Tous les travailleurs, pardon. Laissez-nous faire notre travail. Allez là-bas. Merci. 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 Now, Asian people can't basically go over to South Africa anymore with fake documents and say, hey, we have documents and we are allowed to be here. Now, all the African countries are paying special attention to Asians. Okay, now the world is paying special attention to Asians because China, you guys are f***ing up. You guys are really f***ing up. Pay for these things. The Chinese made it. The Chinese made it. Yeah. Huh? Where did they make it? You have a friend that... When did you, this gentleman came to South Africa? Ask him. You know it's bad when you have people in illustration in hazmat suit dragging foreigners in the street and throwing them in the trash. How ratchet and how ghetto can you be to allow this printed media to take place. You know it's bad when people are saying that this is racist that you don't want me in your building because I'm not the same race as you and the police show up and say that is the building rules. It's just not fair sometimes how the world works but it's up to us to try to stand up to injustice as injustice comes along. The only way we could actually defeat this is by working together and saying, hey, listen, but this is racist. You look stupid. You look ignorant. <sighs> it's such a strange time that we live in. It's a very strange time that we live in. And we don't know what the future holds, but what we can do is work together and try to make the world a better place. Now, the movement of I am not a virus. I'll actually like to take that up. I like to repurpose that. <laughs> I want to repurpose that for black people. I want to I want to get my sign like let me write my sign right now like shoot. I am not a virus. I'm not a virus. Yeah, I want to jump on this movement too. I want to say listen, I'm not a virus. I'm not a virus. <laughs> it's ridiculous, right? Like, tch, you're looking at me and I look crazy, but guess what? I'm not a virus. I need y'all to know that. I need y'all to know that my people that looks like me are not a virus. And I need y'all to understand that this makes you guys look crazy. So let me know what y'all think. Comment down in the comment section down below. If there are any Asian people that's watching my video, thank you for taking the time to watch my video. And I wanna know your opinion about the matter. I really wanna know your opinion about the matter because honestly, an injustice for one is an injustice for all. So take care of yourself and above it all, oof, enjoy your life. Heal the world, make it a better place for you and
and for me and the entire 